Yo, what's going on everybody? Riots here playing Roblox Godzilla, and I just realized that I have now officially acquired all Godzillas on the server, which I find to be a pretty good accomplishment as someone who's coming up on 30 years old. I figured this is like the perfect opportunity to make one of those videos where we like compare all the atomic breaths as they developed and freaking became more epic over the years. Like it's the perfect time. Make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you guys want to be awesome, and let's get right down to the testing. Alright, so here is, I guess I should have started out with a name from the start, huh? This music gets me too excited. I try and do like a normal introduction to this video and I have like this hardcore soundtrack blasting in my ears just spiking my blood pressure and making me want to rip people in half in a mosh pit. It's like the most difficult thing. Okay, so the first one, Gojira, 1955 Atomic Breath. Let's check this out. This server is actually hostile as all hell right now because freaking Destroya just dropped last night and now it's just like everyone freaking going to war with each other. Alright, let's test out this 1955 Atomic Breath. I love how it's all in black and white. This must be so annoying because that poor female Muto doesn't even have a way to like reciprocate damage from far away. She just has to run. Oh, I love that. The roar is called the OG roar. <laughs> they get it right there. Just one last display of epicness since I'm not coming in as this guy anyways. So I don't care if I piss everyone off right now. Easy freaking experience points. Okay, up next on the list, I'd say is Shin Godzilla Form 3, because Shin 2 is pretty much just a big floppy worm not doing anything, where Shin Form 3 is where it starts to get into, like, that amazing blood breath stuff that kind of still gives me nightmares sometimes. Aw, uh, dude, the Mutos are just being, like, the poor example for this entire video, aren't they? The blood vomit is just hardcore, though. Like, Jesus Christ, look at these guys getting down over here. Oh, he just defeated my brethren! Gonna spray this dude down. Oh my god. Blood vomit is just so gross because it, it, it definitely has AIDS in it. There's, there's someone throws up blood at you. You got AIDS now, buddy. I was gonna say, I wonder when he's gonna start reciprocating the annoying crap. I don't even care if this dude survives this, which he's clearly gonna because I'm losing health much faster. He just had blood thrown up on him at the start of his day. No one's gonna have a normal day after having blood puked on him at the start. A day's ruined right there. This, there's no salvaging that day. Day's ruined, whatever, buddy. All right, up next on our Godzilla list, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this little fart over here because that's just for, for the good for the good of everybody. All right, Godzilla Jr. 1993 adaption. I don't know if I'm gonna want to get all the way over there for this one. It's a, it's a long journey just to go over there and get my my butt kicked, dude. This is a lot going. I tried to shut up as long as I could right there so you guys could hear the atomic breath for yourselves. Dude, it is crazy how peaceful it is on here right now. I was on last night and I was I was facing three destroyers as a Godzilla and you know what? I was whooping them too. It was crazy. Everyone who says destroyer is inf ind indestructible. What's going on, fella? I'm about to get so beaten up for this right now. Yep, just making enemies all over the place. It's because they made, like, destroying buildings give you twice as much XP now, so now everyone's just focusing on buildings. It's for the best! Someone needs to spread some chaos around here. Everyone's getting along way too peacefully. Alright, up next on our lovely list of epic legends, I think it's this Gojira right here. Yes, the one that you actually have to get to max level to get destroy. This beautiful creature right here, which I only have to level 35, so I have some work to do. See, this is where the moves start to get freaking beautiful right here. I mean, they're all beautiful based on perspective, but these are just like, in my personal opinion, this is when it starts to get freaking godly. Okay, Godzilla 2014 is next on the list, which I actually only have at level 2. I have just about never played as this guy right here. There's just like, absolutely no purpose, because nuclear Godzilla is just way more powerful. Don't you freaking squeal at me, you little fart? Breath him, Johnny! See, this one's derpy, because this one doesn't move his mouth with the breath either. Ah! Like, he just kind of keeps his mouth wide open. I don't know, they just sort of forgot about this. But he's kicking the crap out of me right now. <laughs> Good for you, little guy. He, he earned this kill. I, I can't take it from him. I gotta stay here and give him the experience. Alright, which makes our next one Titanus Gojira, which is, yeah, it's from Godzilla King of Monsters. That's a beautiful creature right there, which is essentially very similar to the 2014 one, except its mouth actually closes. Yeah, see, look at that opening and closing regular stuff right there. I mean, I get it. You want to encourage people to play as this one more? Oh, that's what I'm talking about. 
Dude, they look so epic when you're down by their feet. This would be such like, oh my god, I would I would freaking kill to be able to play as a person on one of these servers just to see how monumentally epic everything looks. I'm just gonna use my atomic breaths on any of these guys I see walking around because I know they're all just trying to level their dudes up so they can freaking come in here with Destroyer. And then I'm gonna have even more people kicking my butt. You gotta silence the food chain where you can. My poor Godzilla is only like level six. I'm dying in all these freaking atomic breath examples. <laughs> oh my god, I'm just providing experience to them. I'm feeding them. Oh, and I open the menu. Even my Final Wars Godzilla, which is like arguably the most powerful creature in this entire game, is just level one, bro. I'm just gonna try out the atomic breath thing and get out of here. I'm tired of feeding these people. <laughs> if I could just manage to get up it, there we go. What's going on, Mothra? Want to show us off our moves? Poor guys just trying to like get a look out this beautiful map and everything around it, but I mean he had to have seen that coming at least a little bit. I'm about to get beaten up by a Mothra. It, it doesn't feel good on my soul right now as Final Wars Godzilla getting picked off by a freaking Mothra on the beach. But that's just life, bro. As like a level one, you gotta start out somewhere in this cold world. Like, win or lose, you know you don't look good when Mothras go out of their way to attack you. Like, that's just not a good... <laughs> they're not very high on the food chain. Okay, this is the downside to only putting all my stuff towards, like, two or three kaiju. I have two or three excellently leveled ones, and then the rest are just level one victims. So let's just go ahead and just show off some of these atomic reps without going into combat and dying. Hopefully I can just hit him from here. No, that that that's pushing it. They're like barely even in render distance. Still though, that's a pretty beautiful freaking atomic breath right there, baby. Let's get a look at those tail beams. Ooh, that's awesome. Why don't I use this guy more? I totally should. I mean, that's pretty spectacular too. You gotta love like the whole freaking compilation of all those as well. Not to mention you can roar while it's going down. Damn, Shin Godzilla's got it going on in the server. There's a freaking destroyer right there, bro. Can't trust no one these days. I'ma get him. I'ma get him with my with my butt beam. Ah, 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 ah. I recognize that red wing outline. I still PTSD from it. The freaking sneaky Shin Godzilla approaches the sleeping destroyer with extreme caution. Must be super careful with this one. I'm assuming the guy just went to go take a dump. Which, of course, works perfectly for what I'm going for. If I could just kind of angle my back up at him. Ooh, that is what I'm talking about, baby. Would like to see more damage, though, than just the one time. That'd be preferable. I learned when fighting these guys, like, the way they sweep and everything, the main way to try and hurt them is just, like, hurt the tip of their tail. Because that's the part that's always dipping down to the ground, so... It actually works out right here pretty well, too. Oh god, he's awake. Well, this just doesn't look good for anybody now, does it? The hell is this guy doing? He's gonna destroy the crap out of me because I'm like level one, but, but I'm going out fighting. Well, now I just don't understand anything. How is this guy upside down and also in the floor? Nothing really makes sense anymore at this point. The floor is stabbing me. This is like the most difficult possible Godzilla boss to face right here. Floor destroyer? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. I've never actually gotten into a fight as freaking Shin Godzilla before. Oh my god. I didn't even stand a chance. He's in the floor. The, the man is a monster. After Shin Godzilla, there's just Burning Godzilla and Thermonuclear Godzilla. I'm gonna leave those two out right now because, well, they just don't have atomic breath. They have other moves. Plus, my Thermo Godzilla is level 100, and he will vaporize the crap out of this guy. But I was actually gonna make a few, like, other videos regarding max level monsters. Whoop! I'm gonna hit you with my frozen breath, bro. But of course I'm just level four and he's level not and I'm, oh god, it's, it, it, plus, oh, oh my god, oh my god, I need some respect so bad after this. <laughs> this, this whole one has just been whoopings, bro. Even my tail's broken. The, the tip fell off. 
Dude, this place is about to be such anarchy. Anytime you see those Godzillas, it's just people farming them so they can get destroyers. This place is about to be like World War freaking 3 up in here. Or 7? There's already been a few World Wars here. Oh god, I messed with the party. Look at them all activate together. Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's actually... Oh, I'm still trying to use another Kaiju's move, so I'm not familiar with this one's. This guy needs a tail smack, dude. All gods need a tail smack. Wow! The freaking synchronicity around there is just crazy. Alright, I gotta bring in my buddy right there. I gotta clear out the area just for the end of this video, if anything. We need to get some respect. You can't leave a video unattended after getting your butt kicked. Oh, they all started right out next to me. That's perfect. <laughs> I'm now going to freaking kill you all. Oh my god. Never mind, I'm going to kill one of you. There's simply too many, bro. Like, I'm just I'm just outnumbered at the wazoo out there. Oh my god, they start shooting at me before I spawn too. <laughs> Rat bastards. Come on, this one's about to die. Just let him die. Come on. Just die, you bastard. All right. Slowly but surely eliminating the party. Oh. Oh. oh, they spawned me over here. Smart move. I was about to dominate everybody. All right, so I'm getting distracted. This is just an Atomic Breath video. I'm just getting very freaking competitive. But if you guys want to see one where I take on the entire server, make sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!